Michael and Chess, it's finally here. The waiting is over and we couldn't be more happy for you both. With the support of your friends and family here today, we're here to share and celebrate the joy of your wedding. You're taking the first step of your new beginning, your new life together. The expression of love that we get to see today is an expression of the inner love that you have for one another in your hearts. Please be seated. Your marriage begins with the promises you speak to one another today. Chess, do you love Michael willingly and completely, withholding nothing? Will you protect him and give him your deepest considerations of his feelings, desires, and needs? If so, say, I will. I will. Do you welcome Michael as your partner, offering him your love and encouragement, your trust and respect, as together you create your future? If so, say, I do. I do. Michael, do you love Chess willingly and completely, withholding nothing? Will you protect him and give him your deepest considerations of his feelings, desires, and needs? If so, say, I will. I will. Do you welcome Chess as your partner, offering him your love and encouragement, your trust and respect, as together you create your future? If so, say, I do. I do. Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, and always perseveres. Love never fails. But where there are prophecies, they will cease. And where they are tongues, there will be stilled. Where there is knowledge, it will pass away. For we know in part, and we prophesy in part. But when completeness comes, what is in part disappears. When I was a child, I talked like a child. I thought like a child, and I reasoned like a child. When I became a man, I put the ways of childhood behind me. For now we see only a reflection, as in a mirror. Then we shall see face to face. Now I know in part, then I shall know fully, even as I am fully known. And now these three remain, faith, hope, and love. 
but the greatest of these is love. Is love. Chess and Michael have prepared vows that are special to them. The exchanging of these vows will start you on your journey together. And as you share them with one another, know that the love and support of us, your friends and family, go with you. With God as my foundation from this day on, I commit to you. To be your husband, to create a life with you, loving you all the rest of our days. And I commit to you, to the best of my ability, to stand by your side, to play and laugh with you as often as I can, to be honest with you, to comfort you when you are troubled, to support you in that all you dream, to forgive myself and you when needed, to appreciate you and learn from you, to hold the highest, highest good of our family as my priority, to do whatever it takes to maintain a happy and balanced marriage, to live a long, healthy life, still loving each other sweetly and gladly, as I have given you my hand to hold, so I give you my life to keep. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I can't see. I, Chess, take you, Michael, to be my husband. I take you as my friend and love, beside me and apart from me, in laughter and tears in conflict and in peace. I promise to keep our lives exciting, adventurous, and full of passion. <laughs> I will share in your dreams and support you as you strive to achieve your goals. I promise to create and support a, fam a family with you in a household filled with laughter, patience, understanding, and love. I promise to not just grow old together, but to grow together. I promise to preserve when times get tough, knowing that any challenges we face, we have faced together. I promise to support you, inspire you, and above all, love you. For better or for worse, in sickness and in health, for richer or poorer, for as long as we both shall live. Your rings symbolize your commitment in marriage. May they remind you that marriage is not a destination, but a journey with no beginning and no end, a moment-to-moment -moment opportunity to love and be loved to the best of your ability. Brought him, right? <laughs> so in here somewhere. Michael, please place the ring on Chess's left hand and repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring, I make a promise. I make a promise to be your faithful and loving husband. To be your faithful and loving husband. Chess, please place the ring on Michael's left hand and repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring, I make a promise. I make a promise to be your faithful and loving husband. To be your faithful and loving husband. <laughs> Push. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> Little swollen. <laughs> Marriage by John O'Donohue. As spring unfolds the dream of the earth, may you bring each other others' hearts to birth. As the ocean finds calm in view of land, may you love the gaze of each other's mind. As the wind arises free and wild, may nothing negative control your lives. As kindly as moonlight might search the dark, so gentle may you be when light grows scarce. As surprised as the silence that music opens, May your words for each other be touched with reverence. As warmly as the air draws in the light, may you welcome each other's every gift. As elegant as dream absorbing the night, may sleep find you clear of anger and hurt. As twilight harvests all the day's color, may love bring you home to each other. Chess and Michael, today is a celebration of your story. A story that surprised you both 
and made you pay attention to the possibility of love. We're so glad you found each other. You see, it's very clear to all of us here that you share a deep love for each other. We know you love each other because of the comfort and ease that you have when you're together. We see it in the way that you look at one another, respect one another, and share genuine laughter and smiles together. We know it because you work together as a team and you believe in one another. Your family and friends all agree that you bring out the best in each other. Kindness and calm, laughter and joy, motivation and adventure. You're both confident in who you are together and have created the foundation of a bond that cannot be broken. Your love for each other is a testament to the fact that two people can truly, deeply belong to each other. This is worthy of celebration. Your marriage has the unique capacity to transform you both into more loving, generous, and courageous people. Your marriage is a gift to you as you create more space for love, for grace and authenticity. And your marriage is also a gift to the world because the world needs more love, more commitment, devotion, and sacrifice. You've each expressed how you share and hope to create and sustain the sacred values of compassion, commitment, and radical hospitality. You seek to create a marriage filled with compassion, and I hope you do this by practicing compassion both with yourselves and with each other. When you do this, that compassion will be clearly extended to others. You also hope to create a marriage that honors your commitments to one another and to your dreams. You value hard work and perseverance. And in the midst of honoring these commitments, may you also make time for rest and laughter. Protect time with the people that you love and make family time sacred. You also believe in creating a home where everyone who enters is given full permission to be themselves. This starts with you granting this permission to each other. In practicing radical hospitality and kindness, may you show others their value, and may you also remind each other of your value and worth on the days when you forget. Above all, you hope to create a home where love abides. Your love will empower you to share your stories with courage and strength openly as a family. This means that when you face uncertainty, you won't be alone. This means that when scarcity visits, you will be able to draw from the spirit of love that is a part of your everyday life. It means that when you experience moments of joy, you'll be able to practice deep gratitude together. It's my hope, it's our hope, that you are granted years of happiness, joy, and laughter. Your commitment today binds you together in love. And you've just made pretty important promises to one another. Keep them, take them seriously. I hope that you honor the beginning of this journey and that you seek God's wisdom and guidance every step of the way. Yeah. Let us pray. God, we pray for Michael and Chess as they take this exciting step together, as they promise to share their lives, their dreams, their fears, their passions, and their love with one another. God, you are the author of love, and we ask that you guide Chess and Michael, showing them an example of love that is constant and is always filled with grace. We pray that they create a home that allows their love to flourish. Give them gifts of truth, compassion, forgiveness, and trust, and help them live and grow together in the love that you have taught us. Amen. Michael and Chess, you have shared your vows in front of your family and friends. It is at this time that I now pronounce you husband and husband. You can now share a kiss.
I offer this benediction. Go in peace with a reminder of the goodness of love, of God's love for us, and of the beauty of love shared with one another. Family and friends, I now introduce to you for the first time, Mr. and Mr. Britt Leon. Woo!